We want to take you to Nashville right now, where police there say they found the body of missing college student Riley Strain. Let's listen in. I had a company that adjourns the uh, Cumberland River that had been searching for um, anything that would uh, pop up on the river, um, and especially looking for Riley Strain if he would uh, surface here. As they were removing um, an object from the river, uh, they saw, they noticed uh, what appeared to be Riley Strain um, pop up. Uh, the fire department uh, was called in, um, retrieved the body from the river. Uh, the medical examiner's office uh, reviewed the body and we confirmed uh, that it is uh, Riley Strain. Uh, the family uh, has been contacted. Uh, that if there are no signs of foul play at this time, according to the examination here at the uh, riverbank. Uh, Mr. Strain still had the shirt on that he was wearing, uh, so he had the watch and other identifying factors that helped us identify who he is. I want to say uh, to the family, uh, my heart and prayers go out to you all uh, for this very unfortunate and tragic uh, incident. I also want to say thank you to the Nashville community and the outpouring community of the outpouring support from the community uh, in trying to help us locate uh, Mr. Strain. I also want to say thank you to our USAR team and, and to the fire department at OEM and TWRA and everyone else, and including the media, for everything that you've done, for the countless tips that came in. Uh, we received nearly 200 tips as of yesterday that we were vetting out. Uh, so at this time, the family's been notified. Uh, there would be an autopsy uh, more than likely sometime today, and, uh, and we'll have a little bit further uh, from that point. So, thank you. Chief, can you tell us, is there any other additional evidence that, that points you to the theory that it seems like you've been going after for a while now? It's just that he fell into the river you know, accidentally? Yeah, there's no other evidence that suggests anything other than uh, we have reports that uh, normally uh, under these circumstances with, with his height and weight that he could have surfaced between 14 and 20 days. Uh, this is the 14th day, uh, so we were uh, really expecting uh, anytime soon to, uh, to find him. In fact, our search teams was going to put in in the water here uh, this morning and then search from this point further down. Uh, so uh, we were in the right spot. It's just unfortunate. But there's nothing to suggest anything other than any foul play at all. You said that this were crews that were actually looking for him that found him? Yes, that's, uh, so the workers typically on the river, whether it's barge companies, concrete companies, other businesses that actually are on the river, and they uh, they look routinely. It's happened countless times before. And as they moved, I believe, a barge, and don't quote me on that, they removed something from the river, and as they moved it, they noticed uh, Mr. Strain. So. And, ca and called it in. Typically work on the water. They weren't necessarily search crews. Right, right, right. Yeah. Okay. okay, thank you all. Thank you. Thanks. All right, uh, you've just been listening there to a police uh, update on uh, the missing young man, Riley Strain, uh, whose body has now been discovered and identified uh, by police uh, in Nashville. Uh, they say that there are not any signs of foul play. Uh, you'll recall that the missing University of Missouri student was there in Nashville um, with his uh, fraternity. He went missing several days ago. Uh, in recent days, the police had focused a search on the area waterways uh, after his debit card was found in the Nashville River. Uh, they first focused on the Cumberland River's downtown section of that area uh, before expanding the search uh, to include the Chatham Dam. Um, and now uh, we, we had numerous instances of Riley's family uh, making a plea to uh, members of the media and to anyone who had any information about uh, his whereabouts. There was even that video, Chanel, you remember, of him interacting with a police officer mm -hmm. as he was walking down the street. Uh, he was captured on a police officer's body cam. There's some image, uh, some footage here from the Nashville Police Department that show Riley. Um, uh, there was also some audio of him. Uh, here it is. This is the moment where he... Right is um, caught on the police officer's body camera footage. So there was some hope 
that uh, he would be found safe and sad. And of course, the news coming to us now, if you're just joining us here on CBS News, the body of the missing University of Missouri student, uh, Riley Strain, has been discovered. Uh, police say that there are no signs of foul play.